Command Sergeant Major Frank Leota, the U.S. Army Pacific Senior Enlisted Advisor, visited a Japan Ground Self-Defense Force non-commissioned officer course during Yamasakura 63. I was fortunate to come out here to Yamasakura uh, 63 and uh, attend some of the training at the 2nd uh, Sergeant Training Unit about 50 kilometers from here. Uh, it's up in the mountains. Uh, we had a pretty good uh, foot and a half or maybe a foot of snow. The course, based out of Camp Sendai, provides junior enlisted soldiers the leadership skills needed to make the best decisions in a critical combat environment. Uh, they train and develop their young sergeants uh, to become better leaders uh, and take those positions uh, as a squad leader or section sergeant for a crew or a team. Much like the American equivalent, the Warrior Leader course, soldiers learn from both classroom and field training, sharpening their skills in maneuver, tactics, and strategic planning. The development of their non-commissioned officers uh, is, is truly in line with how we uh, train our non-commissioned officers uh, through the teach, coach, and mentor process. Uh, they have a ratio similar to ours of uh, one instructor and between eight to ten students. The conditions here at the Second Sergeant School, Miyagi Prefecture, Japan, are incredibly, incredibly challenging. Yet the NCOs of the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force prove that they can rise to meet and exceed those challenges. Reporting for the 118th MPAD, currently on assignment in Japan, I'm Army Sergeant Jim Boyd.